I find them really pretty or cool because of their attitude, but I'm not all oogly over fucking digital boobs. It just never have been. If you are, that's cool, though. I'm not judging you at all. Um, but let's get on to the ones that I do like. But before that, chicks like Dead or Alive uh, chicks and like Soul Calibers, Ivy and stuff, those girls don't really do anything for me because they're just really fucking gigantic boobs. And I'm just like, okay. I don't know. It just never did it. Anyway, let's get on to it. This is going to be a little bit freestyle. I haven't wrote anything down. Let's go. Number five. Samus. Zero. Suit. I'm not a huge fan of Samus. I think that her, you know, like her... Face is okay, but it's really that damn suit. I mean, come the fuck on. That suit is just like so goddamn attached. The suit might as well be her damn body, and you're just like, Burr. um, but yeah, it is also cool that Samus is a gigantic fucking shooting Mega Man looking bitch, too. That's really awesome. I didn't mean to use bitch in a detonatory sense. I mean, she just whoops ass in both a freaking awesome suit that you didn't even know she was a female, and then she puts on this like freaking tight skin. I mean. You know what the fuck I mean. I'm not gonna explain myself to you. Madeline. Number four, Tess from Witcher 2. Uh, well, I like Tess anyway. She's pretty cool, and she's done a lot of cool shit in the game, but I got to see her titots, and her titots are very nice. I'm going to be honest. I like those titots. That's right. I call titties titots. Don't judge. But uh, in all honesty, I also just like the character herself, and I got a thing for redheads if you haven't fucking know. Shut the fuck up. And uh, yeah, so titots are great. Thumbs up, and uh, she's a cool character. Number three, Trip from Enslaved. Yeah, I know this isn't going to be on a lot of people's list. Um, Noriko or whatever. Yeah, well, I think I said it right for the first time. From Heavenly Store, she was okay, but way too many freckles. And Trip is basically a lot less freckles. She's really cool, sensitive, but also can kick your ass when you have to. And then, of course, she has red hair. Go fuck yourself. I like red hair. But really, she is pretty uh, adorable. I love her. Not like that. I mean, I just love her character design. It's really awesome. Uh, this is so awkward making this when I have a girlfriend. Number two, Prince of Persia's Elika. Honestly, I don't even know if I'm saying her name right, but uh, she's pretty damn cool. You know, I really dug the character interaction between her and the prince, and honestly, she's fine. She is fine. And I think I like her because she's a darker skin than a lot of other characters that are made these days. And that's cool. You don't really see that. Everybody's like pale white vampire looking bitch. And she comes along a little dark, a little musk, a little what, what, what. I'm going to shut, shut, shut your mouth. And I was like, you cool, girl. You cool. But uh, in all honesty, she's also hot as shit. Honorable mention. Four classics. Four classics. That girl from Wet. Let's be real. Yeah, this is Lilith classics. from Borderlands 2. I know she's another redhead. That one chick from Bullet Witch, which was like the only good thing about the entire game. And damn it, I forgot her name, but the girl from Final Fantasy... Oh, it's the name's right there, Ash. Shut up! But she's pretty hot. She got a booty for a Japanese woman! Number one, Lara Croft. But only the new Lara Croft. Classy. I know there's some fans of the old one, but I don't feel the old one at all. She wouldn't even be on my top 20, but the new Lara Croft, hello. Not only is she actually proportioned right, but she's 
beautiful on top of being like the one of the most kick-ass motherfuckers in the world with a bow. She'll fucking, she'll shoot a bow, she'll shoot an arrow in your face. She don't fuck around. She's a survivor, she's cool, she's badass, and she got a booty like, damn. So yeah, overall, Lara Croft's Mike, my number one. The new Lara Croft, not the old Lara Croft. So yeah, that's my top five. Maybe I'm a little controversial. Maybe some of you don't agree. Maybe some of you think I'm a little bit crazy for having these choices. I really don't know. Maybe I am a little bit crazy. So list your top five. Sexy. That's right. That's my sound I make when I'm sexying. Like like that. Like a, like a rat. But uh, no. Put your top five that you think were just like, damn. She fine. I want to hear it. I want to list it. I want to know it. And... I possibly may make a top five hottest guys, because I'm okay with my sexuality in that way. And there's some really handsome guys. Hello, Nathan Drake, somebody? But yeah, okay, I'm not gay. Fuck you. But, yeah, I'm going to end the video here before it gets more awkward. I can't find the exit button.